If you dug a hole to the center of the earth, you'd hit a solid ball of iron and nickel hotter than the surface of the sun. But what if you dug into the other planets? Spoiler alert, it gets weird. First, Mercury. It is basically a flying cannonball. Its core makes up a massive 85% of the planet's radius. It's cooling down and shrinking, literally crushing the planet's surface like a dried up raisin. Then there's Venus. It's Earth's evil twin. We think it has a liquid iron core like ours, but here's the mystery. It doesn't spin fast enough to generate a magnetic field. It's a dead, silent ocean of metal trapped inside a hellish planet. On Mars, we actually know the answer thanks to NASA's InSight lander. It found that Mars's core is liquid, but it's gooey. It's filled with sulfur and oxygen, making it less dense than Earth's. It's a wobbly, molten mess. Now, the gas giants. Forget everything you learned in school. Jupiter does not have a hard rock core. The Juno mission found that the core is fuzzy. It's a dilute mix of rock and metallic hydrogen dissolved together. Imagine a planet without a center, just a thick metallic soup. Saturn is similar. Scientists used ripples in Saturn's rings to measure its core. It's a diffuse, sludge-like mix of ice, rock, and gas. It's less of a core and more of a chaotic slushy. Finally, Uranus and Neptune. These are the ice giants. Their cores are likely rocky, but they are surrounded by a mantle of hot, dense water and ammonia. The pressure is so high, science suggests it rains literal diamonds down onto the core. So Earth is actually the odd one out with its perfect, solid metal heart. Which planet would you dare to visit? Let me know in the comments.